I often say that the ship is really just the canvas and our crew are the color and the paint strokes that bring the experience to life. And we are so lucky to have the very best people. We have the best ships, best brands, best destinations, most innovative and unique guest experiences in the industry. I'm so, I, I, thank, I thank you for going above and beyond every single day to create a lifelong of memories for our guests coming back again and again. As ICON prepares to sail forward, there is no doubt that she will leave a wake of inspiration in her path for years to come and forever change the tides of the family vacation experience. The Royal Caribbean Group is not charting a bold course on one ship or one brand, but each of our three marquee brands, the Royal Caribbean International brand, which we were here tonight, Celebrity Cruises, and, and Silver Sea. In addition to ICON, we launched Celebrity Ascent last month, solidifying Celebrity's cruises, reimagining premium travel. And at the beginning of this month, we named Silver Sea's Silver Nova, representing a new, a new bold vision for ultra luxury travel. In our relentless mission to deliver the world's best vacations responsibly, we will continue to ride a wave of innovation here in 2024 on our journey to net zero. Each of our brands delivers a, a vacation of a lifetime to their guests, and now collectively with a group of brands that appeal that appeals to every life segment, we have an ecosystem that trams a vacation of a lifetime into a lifetime of vacations for our guests. So okay, so let's get let's get to business here, and the reason why we're all here is the christening of the ship. I'm sure you're tired. I'm tired, so you're sure you're tired. Uh, in this grand tradition of maritime ceremonies, we have chosen a truly exceptional individual to preside over this moment. One who has transformed his sport, the GOAT of professional football. Lionel Messi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, perfect. Perfecto. Yo, Hapo, which was one? No, no, no. Poco. Poco is one. Poco. Uh, he really doesn't need an introduction. I mean, he is the list of records throughout his career, which includes the World Cup in Argentina in 2022. The prestigious Balloon d'Or, eight times, by the way. And then he was named Times 2023 Athlete of the Year. He's also introduced a new era of excitement, passion for soccer in Miami and across the U.S., and I suspect he will, ever, he will ever forever transform the sport power and popularity here in America. The icon of his sport is now our icon for icon. But I do want to give you a different lens of Leo. Um, when I first met Leo and his family last year, I knew him solely, like many of you, as, his, as for his football accomplishments as being the GOAT. Within seconds of being with him, it was clear that his top priority was not the pursuit of being the very best or winning on the soccer field. It was actually his family. Watching the endearment and love for his wife, Antonella, and his three boys made it obvious that his priori where his priorities lie. And Leo and Antonella carry that family focus forward in life decisions they make and the organizations they support. As a father of four myself, it was this interaction that I realized where Leo's true passion lies, and I will, I will now forever see him first as a husband, as a father, who just happens to play soccer really, really well. Uh, in just a few moments, Leo will take part in one of my favorite traditions. He will have the honor of bestowing the seat keeping and good luck of the ship and the crew with the breaking of the champagne bottle over the bow of the ship. Of course, in keeping with that, that passion um, of always doing things bigger and bolder, the bottle that we use to christen the ship in itself is iconic. It's the largest production bottle made, and it's, the most it's for the most iconic ship in the world, of course. Yes, it was fun creating the impossible here with Icon, but I can tell you firsthand that it's even more fun to experience it. So let's christen the ship and enjoy the iconic way for families to come together and make memories of a lifetime. Thank you all again for being here for the naming ceremonies. And I'm going to hand it over here to Mario so we can begin the commencement of the, of the, of the, of the christening. Mario. All right. Thank you, Jason. Thank you. All right. The time has come.
for us to officially name Icon of the Seas, Michael and Captain. If you would please join Leo. All right, let's get a look at the bottle. Wow. There's that big bottle. <laughs> okay, I believe we are ready to go, but uh, we're missing the bottle release device. We need that. <laughs> honor of naming our beloved new ship, blessing her and all that sail on her for many years to come. Bueno, muchas gracias, Jackson. Antes que nada, me gustaría eh, agradecer a, tu, a todo el grupo Rocha Caribbean por darme este privilegio. Es un gran honor para mí. Sé lo que significa este barco para la ciudad de Miami y para el mundo entero. Así que sin ir más, nombro este, este barco I go on the seas. Dios lo bendiga y a todos los que nos vienen. Bueno. 